I believe that everyone has the experience of taking a medicine, right? Medicine becomes a lifesaver when you are having a headache or a stomachache. Every once in a while, we can see a new medicine put up in the drugstore. But do you know how long does it take to develop a new medicine from the very beginning? On average, it takes about more than 10 years for a new drug to complete its journey from initial discovery to the marketplace. Why does it take so long? The most important reason is that it is very difficult to find suitable people to test the drug. Currently, animals such as mouse is often used to pre-select the candidate drugs from an ocean of chemicals. Countless mice have been sacrificed for this purpose. But even so, because human and animals are biologically different, about 90% of the drugs that has passed animal testing still fail when tested in human. Is it possible for us to find a better way to select the drug? I would say yes. And this is my research theme. As we know, liver is the center of metabolism in our body. When selecting the drug, one important parameter is to know if the drug will damage our livers. Therefore, I'm focusing on building a liver in a dish that can be used as a model for drug testing. Cells that exist in our liver will be put together and grown in a petri dish. Actually, many scientists have been also trying to build such a model, but the difficult part is to find a good source of such cells since we cannot just ask people to give us their liver cells. In my model, I am using cells that are derived from human iPSC. iPSC is a stem cell that can be developed from our skin cells. It is very powerful and has the potential to become any type of cells in our body. Since skin cells are much easier to obtain, the source is nearly unlimited. With the help of a liver in a dish, we can quickly decide whether the medicine is dangerous or not. Using everyone's skin cells, we can also build such a model for everybody. In this way, medicine and treatment can be personalized to match everyone's health condition. I believe that in the near future, the development of new medicine will become much easier and we can all live a better, healthier life. Thank you. Mm -hmm.